we were at lunch, and this girl who shared the cabin with me, she thought we should be starting to pack. So, of course, I left the table and went with her to the cabin, and we were just inside when there was this noise. Oh, it was a terrific explosion, a terrific one. And it sounds as if it was right near too. It frightened the life out of me. The torpedo strikes the ship just behind the bridge. A spout of water, steam, and black dust erupt somewhere behind the forward crow's nest. Oh, people pushing, shoving, to get up as high as they could, getting near the back. Almost immediately, the ship lists sharply to starboard. The lifeboats on that side swing away from the ship. On the port side, the lifeboats swing in. Lowering them becomes almost impossible. The lifeboats went up and down and they were out of order because they couldn't run, they were all crooked. So they had just to fill the boat and lowered it down by hand. And then when they got to the water, they cut the rope. And of course, the first two overturned and the people were thrown in the water. We come to an open space, got my hands in prayer, and I said, please God save us, please God save us. In the mounting panic, nursemaid Alice Lines wraps three-month-old Audrey into a shawl and ties it around her neck. Then she heads for the lifeboat with Audrey's older brother in tow. I followed best I could to get into the sand, into the lifeboat and an officer came and grabbed me and he said you can't go in that's full and I said I must my boy is in there and I've just put my boy in there I must and I got myself free from him and they were lowering the lifeboat and I jumped Trying to escape the onrushing seas, other passengers climb to the highest points on the ship. I had my sister Florence with me. We got to the poop deck next to the funnels. And so we were, went down with the sink and when she got to where we were on the top, we just went into the ocean. My life belt slipped off. And I was holding on to Florence, but I couldn't hold on any longer. I had to let her go. That was very traumatic. That lasted this hand, it was this hand. Lasted till I was 19 or 20 years old. I could still, that's extraordinary, I still could feel the grip. Oh yes, this is my baby. <laughs> mm, that's right. Seventy-nine years have passed since Alice Lyons wrapped three-month-old baby Audrey in her shawl and jumped for a lifeboat. She's a very dear close friend and it means a great deal to me because she saved my life.